Exclusive. Johnny Depp and Amber Heard won't be facing off in a Virginia courtroom anytime soon, it seems. In yet another delay in the trial start of the former Pirates of the Caribbean star's Assetis $50 million defamation lawsuit against the Aquaman actress, the former couple now will trade barbs and evidence starting April 11, 2022. The trial is expected to last about two weeks. Already rescheduled several times, the trial had been set to start May 7, which was looking like the final mad rush of discovery and depositions. The new date was decided Tuesday by Fairfax County Circuit Court Chief Judge Bruce White. The last time the fuming matter was postponed was back in September of last year. While Depp had been advocating for a new delay then because of his Fantastic Beasts 3 shooting schedule, White actually pushed the date from January 2021 to May due to backlogs in the state's court system because of the coronavirus pandemic. And, to the frustration of some involved, that's kind of the reason this time too, as the April 2022 date was the first available slot for a civil jury trial, I hear. As with last September, criminal cases are still the priority in Virginia. In that context, and with proceedings slowly starting up again as COVID-19 continues to rage across the nation, a murder trial with a defendant who is already behind bars was given the Depp Heard May 7th date. With Depp's UK lawyers anticipating an oral hearing next month in their attempt to appeal their loss in the actor's libel suit against the Sun tabloid, the significant date shift in Virginia barely lowers the volume in the loud matter. For one thing, Heard countersued her ex-husband for $100 million last summer after failing to get the initial suit dismissed. In fact, in the UK, Heard's team recently filed an opposition to the appeal there, and Depp's barristers have until February 28 to reply. Having been axed from the Fantastic Beasts franchise in November, mere days after Judge Andrew Niddle's damning, wife Beta, ruling against Depp, the actor has been on a subpoena binge in the US of late. The ACLU and Elon Musk were pulled into the Virginia case earlier this month, by Depp. That follows her dragging Pirates studio Disney and the LAPD into the matter in January for basically everything that they might or might not have on her ex. Among those high-profile names in this very high-profile case, free speech non-profit the ACLU is in the spotlight again in the case because the group was among the two organizations to which Heard said five years ago she was donating half of her $7 million divorce settlement. Despite years of insisting on the donation and an ACLU ambassador for women's rights role for Heard, it turns out that Big Bucks payments have been delayed, according to what the actress attorney Elaine Breedhoff told Deadline in January.